uh, Drake did the same thing. You know, he gave him a beat, the 100 beat, and, you know, Drake came out with a record that was a super fucking hit. And, you know, sometimes you do things to some people out of respect that you wouldn't do to another person because you respect them. You know what I'm saying? And I can't tell you what they talked about or what happened behind the scenes. I just know when he smacked Drake that uh, my phone started going off the hook. Wait, did he smack Drake? Hold up. And uh, my man and them was with him actually at Drake. Live Nightclub when it happened. And uh, they started, they called me and told me everything that happened. I said, yo, your man spazzed out last night when he seen Drake. So what happened, I really don't know. You know, I know that they got over it and that they cool now. Couldn't be me, though. Damn. You know, going through all these situations, man, how often would you see Diddy just go off on somebody? It's, 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 it's a difference. He always stood his ground. And that's one thing that I could say. He always stood his ground. You know, after that situation happened with uh, Drake, him and Jay Prince got into it and he stood his ground. You know, when it comes to things like that, he's, I, I could never say he's soft. He always going to step up to the plate when it comes to situations like Yo, Diddy never came off as an aggressive person. That's why I'm just like, when I hear stuff like this, I just be confused. Like, cause he don't come off as a type on some gangster shit, bro. Like, oh, it's hard to believe. He smacked Drake? I got to look. I gotta do some more research on that. Like that. But in the last couple of years, I've seen it full throttle. You know, I seen it full throttle. I don't know if it was because he was getting older and he needed to feel relevant. I don't know if he was getting high too much. I don't know, but I I seen it go full throttle in the last couple of years. Do you know what happened between him and Jay Prince? It was basically that Drake is signed to Jay Prince. So he he didn't like the fact that Puff smacked him. You know what I'm saying? So, you know, he called and threatened him and stuff like that, you know, and, and Puff stood his ground. You know? Did they ever run into each other? I, like, I, at that part, I can't tell you because I haven't been around him. I, I, you know, I just was privy to that information from somebody that was there that called me and told me about it. But if they ever jumped, if they ever seen each other, it was one time when we used to be in Houston and they was cool. You know what I'm saying? But like I said, behind doors in 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 society, it seemed like we got a beef or seemed like this, but we've talked it out with just us. So when you on that level right there, you on the J Prince level, you on the Diddy level, we on the workers level, we might not never hear that situation or that conversation. Mm. Okay. All you know is that when you go into that town, you 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 ready, not even knowing that they already talked and not even knowing whether it's a situation or something like that or not. Those sometimes work out good, sometimes they work out bad because sometimes we've been in places where we didn't even know we had a situation where him and somebody else might have got into an argument on the phone. And then you don't find out until you actually there. You know what I'm saying? So bro, security guards need way more money than what, than what they be getting paid, bro. Imagine putting your life on the line for somebody else and they beef, bro. And you got to protect this person, bro. Nah, I, can't. I need like at least a mil a year, bro. That's a gift and a curse. Can get tricky. Yeah, it's definitely tricky. Each and every day you walk out your house could be your last. You never know. For somebody else, he, and, and that's that's the bad thing about Puff right there is that he don't let you in on everything that he's going through. That's dead wrong, eh? So from what I'm hearing so far, Diddy done hung Wale off a porch or a balcony, and he smacked Drake. What's up, bro? What else is out there, bro? What else did this guy do, bro? To be continued, man.